Hello everybody, yes, how are we all doing? It is the Fredders93 here and welcome back to another episode here in the playthrough of the campaign of Zombie Army 4 Dead War. Now how about we just jump straight back into it? In this Bruno, no sign of the dot. But he left us recorded instructions to blow up the hell gate in the lab. <laughs> Schweiger always was the kind to think one step ahead. Well then, get to it. You were born to build. Alright, so we've got everything we need here. A couple of trip mines, a couple of teller mines, although what are these? Divine grenades, we don't really have much of a use for the divine grenades. Now let's get into the research lab. Well, better head to the lab. It's bomb building time. Ah, you must be the reinforcements. My name is Carlos. I'm one of Dr. Schweiger's assistants. Good to find someone still alive. Is Dr. Schweiger with you? Dr. Schweiger went ahead to the hailstorm. I was supposed to finish assembling the bomb, but the lab is filled with the dead. I can't get the power. Now you can help me. I will walk you through the process. Firstly, you need to find three fire components and attach them to a core. Thanks for all the help there, pal. Right, so we've got some firing components to find. Target down. That's right. So I'm guessing it must be down a level. Because yeah, we're getting close to them to about there. Okay, so they must be down a level. So down we go. Double kill there. That's one piece. It's one bit there. Where's the others? It's a bit more like it now. If I'm well, where's the other one? So this one's done. What's in that box there? So now we've got incendiary grenades and frag grenades here. This one back up. Around here. on the floor down. Should we say what's in you? Nice little vault around there. Oh, you are an upgrade kit though. Reload just a bit quicker, please. That's a bit better. 
Any last thing I need you? No. Because you must be in here. Duly noted. Now, where are these going to go? Let's go go. Okay, now what? Just strap it to a rocket? That's fine. Now the firing components have been installed, we must calibrate the core. Head to the calibration bay and begin the sequence. Guys, calibrating now. Right, so what? Okay, so which um, I. Which way are you back up to then? Oh god. So, absolutely insane. What is hat? Ooh! Kill clip. Oh god. Kill clip on a suicide too. I haven't had one of those in a while. We've got to move to the infusion chamber, which is here. Okay, that's done. What now? Now head to the room above you and activate the radiation induction module to infuse Oof. the core with arcane energy. It's the big red button. You can't miss it. Copy that. Okay. Let's start the turbines to build the charge. I believe is should be just around here. Creeper. Push the red button. Is that it? Now we wait for the induction module to charge. Once it's finished, we release the charge into the core and pray it doesn't detonate. By pressing the release button. Just to make sure you're safe in the induction module. You do not want to hear those coils when they fire. I mean, creepers. Creeper down. Could really do it with some. Uh... I'm alright right now. Here's the power of the arcane. Fusion complete. Can I get out of here now? Not, not quite. Next, we need biofuel. Head to the oh, testing sake. room downstairs. The one with all the stasis tanks. There's always Head something more, isn't the there? Testing Check. A testing room is not quite where I thought it was. Yeah, that's it. In there's the testing room, okay.
Oh, for God's sake. Panzer Shrieks, Panzer Shrieks, Digger. I think this lot can just burn themselves when they land. So we can do this. Uh, maybe we probably shouldn't have done that. I think that's probably doing us more. Harmony is good. Now I dump it in the core, right? Take the biofuel to the core and place it in carefully. And then we're done? Still no. You must activate the induction to infuse the core once more. Only once that is done will our weapon be complete. Got it. Any more that I can pick up from you guys? Any more for any more? It appears not. It's quite alright. Pick up the telemines out. Right, where else can we. Now, more with this. This ammo is already full. They're the divine grenades, which we're not really massive fans of. Right, so buy a few to the core. Now the final infusion turbines. Same room as when we started the others. Yep. Now where are this lot gonna come from? One from down there. Commander's frenzying the horde. Oh, no, you don't. Dealt with. Plenty of use coming from over there. All out of ammo. Right, let's release the charge. Biofuels in and infused. It's ready. Aha! Excellent work. Now, let's take it to take our warhead and attach it to the missile. Head in blast doors and Open them up for you. Okay, now we're talking. Guess I'm on a roll. Hell yeah, we're on a roll. Commander!
right now. Where else are going with this? The rocket housing. Which was over there. Not even anywhere near where I thought it was going to be. But that's quite alright. Well, I don't know where anyone else, but I'm absolutely loving it, this game. Watch out, there might be some zombies lurking in the transport tunnel. Whoa, that's a bit more than some. Nothing you cannot handle, hey. Once you have installed our brand new arcane core into the missile and proceed to the signal, I shall be waiting for you there. God damn it. Kill confirmed. Oh, for God's sake. I know where's the safe room. Safe room, safe room, safe room, let me in, let me in. Let me in. Thank God that chapter is completed there. However, that is going to do it for this part of the Zombie Army Tour playthrough. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoy it. Do leave that like, subscribe if you're new around here, and I'll see you guys very soon. Take care. Bye bye for now.